Let's take a look at how we can make text wrap around a picture, or as some word processing programs call it, floating the picture on the page. If you look at my page right now, you can see that I've just inserted a picture, and there's a lot of white space to the right of it. And I don't want that. I want the text to start right at the top of the picture and just kind of flow around or wrap around that picture. Well, in Google Documents, this is a really easy thing to do. All I need to do is click on the picture, and when I click on it, you'll see I have two choices down below, in line with text or fixed position. Right now, in line with text is what is selected be because it's in bold. And what in line with text means is that it's just a part of the text, and it lines up with the line of text that I inserted it on. If I clicked fixed position, fixed position means that I can move my picture around the page and everything else will just wrap around it. So you notice I moved it to the right hand side and now my text just kind of naturally flows around that picture. It's kind of cool because if you do this you can also move it a little bit outside the margins of your text and just give your page a little bit more uh, of lines, a little more interest, draws the eyes in. So again, remember your choices are in line, and then it's just going to be part of the text, or this fixed position, which allows you to move things around. As soon as you're done, just click away from the picture, and it will be locked into that position for you. If you want to move it again, you can just grab it and move it back over on this side if you like that better, and whatever you want, or you want to lose it. Now, if you'll see that at times this picture does axe up on you, if that happens to you, just go back to inline with text, back to fixed position, and then move it where you want it. That seems to fix it for me each time I have a problem like that. Practice with it, play around with it, it's a pretty cool uh, thing to use.